All right, well, it's Money Monday, and today we are talking about how you can avoid unnecessary expenses if you're having di difficulty getting or staying pregnant. Yeah, the president and CEO of Great Lakes Credit Union, of course, is in here, David Seeger. He joins us live this morning. Good morning, morning, gentlemen. Uh, but as always, before we get into this day, we're going to take a look at our markets. And, and what are we seeing here today? Markets going gangbusters. As a matter of fact, they're, they've been accelerating over, overnight. Um, the um, Dow is up, the S&P is up, and NASDAQ and Russell bouncing on the good news from last Friday. 195,000 jobs were created in our economy in the month of June, so good news. Are all good signs. Like we said last week, we're seeing con week and week continuing good news, good oh, news definitely, coming. Definitely. So economy definitely strengthening. It looks for Wall Street. All right, well, we'll, we'll look about that. We'll talk about it a little later. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. All right. Well, moving on to the topic at hand, we're talking about the cost of infertility. Obviously, a growing problem in the U.S. Almost and a very definitely. expensive problem. Very as well. much so. A matter of fact, according to the um, Center of, uh, for Disease Control and Prevention, 6.1 million women in the United States uh, between the ages of 15 and 44 have difficulty either getting pregnant or staying pregnant. Mm -hmm. So it's a huge problem. And um, according to the American Society of Re uh, Reproductive Medicine, there were 59,446 um, assisted um, uh, 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 pregnancies uh, uh, for, for babies being born in 2011. Wow, that's so a big so there's, there's, yeah. it is a huge number. So the, this, this is a, one of the main things that we're looking at here in the United States. The cost for assistance, and it can run, run anywhere from $12,000 to $160,000. So $160,000? $160,000 on the high end of the spectrum, depending on what you're having done. Wow. Sure. Now, for, for a regular uh, birth, it's about 10 1500 total cost for having, having a, a normal birth, birth, but if you have a situation where you're having trouble getting pregnant or staying pregnant and we need some intervention and treatment, uh, then it gets pretty expensive. Yeah. Some of those things like um, freezing eggs, for example, that can cost anywhere from $3,000 to $12,000. Mm -hmm. uh, there is a storage fee as well as associated with that, and that's what makes it kind of expensive. Uh, Interuterine insemination, the cost is about $2,000. It has about a 6% chance of success, but uh, it is usually the first line of treatment. Ovulation induction, the cost is about $2,000. Introplasmic sperm injection, about $2,000. Intro vitro fertilization costs twelve thousand five hundred per cycle, and it may take two or three times before it, it actually will uh, take. Wow. So you're, you're talking expensive dollars here. And pre-implantation genetic di di diagnostics six thousand dollars. Adoption um, as much as forty thousand dollars, particularly if you adopt abroad. A lot, but a lot of that is attorney fees. Up up to twenty thousand dollars in attorney fees wow. just in that, so it gets really expensive. And surrogacy up to one hundred sixty thousand dollars to pay somebody to carry a child for you. So those are some of the costs associated with these type of situations with infertility. Wow. So we're talking about some serious cash coming out of a while. And then you couple with the fact that uh, raising a child to about the age of 18 would cost something like $200,000. Oh, a little more than that, yeah. You're talking right. some serious, serious cash. Most wow. definitely. Most definitely. Wow. Well, next hour, we're going to look into some ways to pay for that and some financing for very that so. to help uh, mitigate some of those expenses for some couples who need it the most. Very much so. All right. Thank you very much, David. Well, coming up after the break. Uh, Therese joins us with what's look a uh, look. I'm sorry, what's happening in your sports segment? That's coming up next.